EasyBib is an excellent add-on available inside of Google Docs to help you build a <clears throat> reference at the end of your paper. So what you need to do to, to use it is to go to the add-ons tab and you need to get the add-on before you can use it. So that is right here, it says get add-ons. You will search for EasyBib Bibliography Creator in this box right here. It's sitting at the top for me. It's something I already have. You will see the word get the add-on, or it might actually say free. You'll click on that. You will give some permissions for it to be able to access your documents in Google Drive, and then you'll be all set and ready to use it. So here's how you do that. You go back to the add-ons tab and you go to EasyBib Bibliography Creator, and then we're going to manage a bibliography. That's going to open up that sidebar over there. Um, there are some things you want to decide. First of all, what type of reference source you're going to be using. We're going to start with a website. And the other thing is here's where you're going to choose your style. And so you can um, drop this menu down and select whatever style you like. We're going to use APA style. All right, so let's say we would like to use this article uh, out of Edutopia. So we're going to go up here in the Omnibox, copy the URL, go back to our document that we are creating, and we're going to paste that URL right here, and then click the button that says Search and you'll see it will populate um, a, a guess. And in this case, the guess looks perfect. That is the title of the article. And so we'll click the select button and it's going to create the reference for our reference page. All right, the next thing um, we should try is a book. You can search for books in a couple of different ways. The title, the ISBN number, or the keyword. ISBN number is a really cool way to search because you can get that right off of that um, white barcode on the back of every single book. And you can type the ISBN number right into the box. Pasting one in, we're gonna search. And there is the book that it is associated with. We can click select to add that to our bibliography. You can also search by title. And you can see just the title, you'll get a lot of results if you also add the author. That will help narrow down search results. And there's our book that we want to use right at the top. Click select. And there is our book added to our bibliography. And then finally, let's look for a journal article title. So by typing the title of a journal article into the box, um, it will give you great results. If you also add, again, the author's name to your search, you're going to get a much smaller list, and that will help you decide which one to pick. And so here is um, a paper journal article that I want to add to my bibliography, my reference sheet. And once you have the sources that you have used in your paper, you click the red button that says add bibliography to the doc. It will append it at the end of everything that you have typed. So this will be your reference page last. Um, you will still need to uh, adjust for pagination and just check really quickly to make sure the entries look like you expect them to look. And that's how to build a bibliography with EasyBib.